This is the final Pro Tour Championship 1995 Epic Reyes vs. Kim Levin 4. And this is Rock number one. And capped it off when he made the nine ball on the break, and that wrapped up everything. And uh, he beat the Miz 11 4, and here he is now. And we'll see if he continues the magic he had in that regard. Yeah, he's made one already. And he's got. Well, I think he's probably got the cue ball in the one ball in pretty good shape again, hasn't he? Well, the key here is going to be he's got a good shot on the one, but the problem is how to get the cue ball lined up for position on the two. See, when he cuts the one in that corner pocket, the uh, cue ball is going to go the right up to the table. So he's got to try to figure out how to get it back down table. I tell you, and he's going to look like he's reverse and try to go two rails off the right side. They call him the magician. The question is, is it hard enough? No, I don't think so. It's going to leave him a little more difficult shot than he had imagined. But he, uh, we've seen him do some unbelievably magical things. <coughs> What's he going to do? Cut this two ball back, or is he playing safe, or what? Safety. Safety. Going to try to snooker him with that green six ball there. And he did exactly what he's trying to do. Looks like he did it, Nick, didn't he? Huh? Sure did. So here's Kim Davenport, the defending champion. He's going to try to curve around the six, hit the back rail, knock the two up table, and play safe. He did that exactly, yeah. and now if he gets a favorable bounce and can hide it, well, he did a little longer bounce off that side rail, and he might have had that thing hidden. That was still a good shot from there. Mm -hmm. He made a great shot there. At least after him, he has to make a good shot to start out here. He's got a shot. He's just... The way he has to come off, he has to be careful of the side pocket. The way he has to come off of the two. Makes it. No, well, he come close, buddy. <laughs> he did. Yes, he, he come did. close to yeah, that side, but he made a nice a shot. Yes, he did. Yeah. And he had a lot of green between cue ball and the two ball. He's a masterful player. Yeah, he's got to bring the cue ball all the way back for the ball right by the cue ball, the five ball. Watch out. Six ball slowed him down, but it didn't bother him enough. He'll have the five ball in the corner up there on the right side. And then what will he do about the six? Where will he put that thing? He'll probably draw underneath of it. Oh, he could take it all the way back down the corner, isn't he? Huh? Apparently. And put some follow on it for the seven. Huh? Not uh, much, though, huh? Basically, he's just going to go head to the right and play the seven in the same pocket. Masterful handling of the cue ball and the stick. Working his way beautifully through this rack. Now the eight ball and the nine. And it appears that he's going to open up with a 1-0 lead. Efren wins the rack. This is round oh, number two. You just, I don't think you can let him stand there and break these balls all night and expect to beat them. But, uh, <laughs> no, you can't. Uh -uh. Huh? Needs one. Didn't get one. Is he going to come up empty? Yeah, I believe he came up yeah. empty. And he's he left uh, that one ball, huh? Yeah, he's left Kim a really good shot. Yeah. Now we'll see about Davenport, young man from Modesto, California. What great mental toughness he showed us. Down 9-2 to two and 10-4 sure to four and 10-5. to five, And he came back to beat Archer in that thrilling semifinal event. And, of course, Archer must feel as though he's snake bit and jinxed. Every time he's had a magnificent year, he just can't win the big one. Right. He, he is pretty, fairly simple out here. Well, he's got to be a little careful. Two balls down on this end of the table. You gotta oh, get by that come ball. on, come on, yeah. come on. Well, he did, just did. I'll tell you what's a little tricky on this two, three, four. Well, he's got to play the two and the three in the same pocket. Right. Yeah, but he needs an angle to get back to the four, see? Yeah, he needs to cross that line and get back toward the middle of the table. 
Well, he could have used a little bit better bump off that five, couldn't he? Well, Where's I, he going to put the three ball? He must looking. have been playing it for the side, I guess. I don't... That's not an easy shot to cut that in the side, is it? Can you, no, I don't think he was playing it for the side. I think he just overcut the two a little bit. Could have been. Came up short. Yeah. Because the, the three doesn't look like it fits in the side. He can't get it by the six ball. It How about banking it then? Right straight across and back. That might be the shot. That might be the shot considering where the four's at. He's going to cut it. He's not going to bank it. Oh, it oh it's beautiful. Right beautiful. It needs to bounce off the five. All right. That's a beautiful shot. I um, Actually, that worked out pretty good because now when he cuts the four in that left upper corner pocket, he'll come around two rails. I think he can avoid the eight and uh, fall for that uh, five for right the five. in the side. Okay. He can get the five He's in one side and the six in the other. Like so, to play position on the five. They just come two rails out of the corner. Oh. And he has left this table wide open for Reyes, and that is a no-no. Oh, boy. Reyes will run this table without a blink of an eye. He was probably playing too much position and got over, huh? Just overplayed the shot. Reyes will cut that in the corner, rattles it in. Come back, he'll put the five down in the other corner. Lower right-hand corner as you watch from above. And you'll have the six back across on the other side. And he'll be, um, he'll bring it back just a little bit so you're right in line for that seven, I imagine, huh? Yeah, straight in is a perfect place mm -hmm. for the seven. All he wants to do when he shoots the seven is just shoot and stop. Yeah, takes it right off the rail. Stop it, put the eight up in the corner. He's gonna be up two zip. Is the nine, nine ball isn't against the rail. All right, it's, it's a real soft shot here. He just come one rail down. Maybe use this side rail over here. No, he used the end rail instead. Mm -hmm. Off the rail and set up perfectly to put the nine ball in the corner and take a two nothing lead. Everett wins the round. Don't this is rock number two. championship. This is Reyes, Efren Reyes of the Philippines. Number one player, certainly in his country, conceivably in the world. He's out in front, two racks to none. And he will, uh, I don't know what he can do with that one ball. That looks like, I don't think he can cut it back. He's, he's either going to have to, I, I believe he can play it down the corner. Do you think that's so? a scratch, isn't it? As you watch Kim Davenport look on, Kim's got to get back in this game. He can't let Reyes get that far ahead, down yeah. to nothing. Isn't that a scratch if he... No. Huh? Now he'll play it down the corner. He'll just go straight to this rail and just a little bit. He, he'll come about to there. Uh, but he didn't, and he did make it. Isn't that something? What a fortunate little bounce, and he's all set now for the two in the other corner. The three's the one that's really the problem. The three, the ball is down by the nine. In fact, he may even play for the combination here. He may play for the combination on the nine. take the nine ball. In fact, he's eyeballing it while he contemplates what he's going to do with the two ball, where he's going to put the cue ball. He'll have to bring it all the way back down to the corner. Right Didn't about. do it. <clears throat> he's coming right back where he was at. I don't know if he got far enough or not there. I don't either. Take a look at him up uh, above. Between me and that three. ball. This eight ball right here may have him blocked. He may not have a path to the three. He may be curving it a little bit. Yeah, he is curving. Missed it. Oh, he missed it. Wow. wow. I tell you, Davenport has ball in hand. that is one of the few times you will see Reyes make a mistake like that. I believe Cam will shoot the combination. I don't blame him. He's down 2 nothing. And this looks like an ideal chance to get right back into this contest and be down 2-1 and have the cue ball ready for the break. This is a real easy combination. He won't, he won't have much problem with this, I don't think. Get his ducks lined up in a row. That's right. <laughs> Thank you.
game wins the rack. And it opens the door, and Davenport rushes right through it to get into this match. It's 2 1. This is rock number six. I've been so good from up here making no shots. <laughs> Two and three cushions. Yeah, Tom, you were at three racks while ago. I did indeed. Just, um, <laughs> you know, they were. <laughs> <laughs> they were throwing babies out of the balcony. They didn't know I could do that. <laughs> now we'll see about Davenport in this break. Well, oh, he's breaking them hard. You know, that could be the difference in this whole match. But the seven's trying to play havoc with him. Yep. If he can't play the three in this corner, he may have big problems with the three, huh? Right, he may have, have another shot, too. Well, what can he do with it? Bring well, that cue ball back to, after he makes the one. What's he going to do to it? Well, he, he can pull the cue ball all the way down and maybe play the combination in the side. Oh, I see. Right. Or he may be able to go all the way down underneath it and play the three up here in the, other, in the same pocket he's playing the one. Or he may be able to hit it. And oh, get a nice, a nice shot. Very nice. Beautiful. <laughs> nice shot. Beautiful shot. Yeah, took that eight ball right out of there, took it out of play, and now he's still got enough room to maneuver that cue ball and the three ball and put it in the pocket. That's Scott Smith, the referee, checking, make sure that Kim Davenport doesn't touch her. Move another ball while playing the shot. That would be a foul. Very nice. Looked for a moment like he almost overplayed that, but he got it in there, drilled it in. Uh, the only problem I see here may be the seven ball. Six to the seven. Davenport trying to run the table to even this at two racks apiece in the race to 11. Body English in addition to everything yeah. else on that, didn't he? Yeah, that's, sure that's a common English that all pool players <laughs> use. <laughs> <laughs> we have a lot of different methods yeah. of, of some people jump. Other that's people, right. You know, when they shoot, they jump on the ball, and others, when they shoot, they squat. Yeah. <laughs> and they all come they up later and say, boy, you know, I don't know why my back hurts so much. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's got a real speed control shot here. He's got to hit this good. He's going to hit two rails uh, hit short of the side and try to float down between that eight and nine. He hit it great. Oh, He's right nice. there. Very and nice. And that just requires played. marvelous speed yeah. control. Beautiful shot. He's trying to take um, advantage and move to a 2-2 two -two tie. Taking his time. I would follow this ball. I wouldn't draw it. I would follow it. He's thinking about drawing it. There's uh, Kim's wife, Aida, looking on. Mm -hmm. Now he's following it. Mm -hmm. If she worked her way through about four sets of fingernails in that match <laughs> with Archer. <laughs> Beautiful. Now Davenport with the nine ball to tie this. At two. Kim wins the rack. This promises to be a great match. You stay tuned. We're tied at two. It'll... <laughs> We're tied at three games apiece. And now Efren Reyes, the young man from the Philippines. This is rough number break. seven. He gets after it, too. He did a masterful job in this department against Steve Miserak. Got kissed away. Oh, they're coming up dry. Yeah, all of a sudden. In fact, it was um, it's weird to think about that because Reyes, in that semifinal match with the with the Miz, was making two and sometimes three balls with a break. Yeah. So I think he can play this ball in here. He may be able to bring the cue ball this direction. He'll have to force a little bit. If not, he'll have to bring it straight back. But he's got a good shot either way. One ball in the corner, brings it back now for the two ball, put that in the side. Then the three ball back up in the corner. The four ball lays over against the side rail, or right there in front of the side pocket. He needs an inside angle, really, to be accurate with it, but he will settle for just pulling it back and then hitting the side rail and coming across. If he could um, 
after he makes the two. Then the three, if he could bring that cue ball back almost to where it is now, between the eight and the six, huh? Well, that, that would be okay. He really needs to play, considering where the five is at, he needs to be able to play the four down in the corner. Oh, really? I see. All right. Okay. He needs to be straight in on the four. No, he's going to take it inside. Well, that, that's what you're talking about. You meant straight on in there, huh? Well, I meant straight down, down the in the corner. corner. I thought you did it first. Yeah, but if he puts that in right there and stops it right there, he's still got a very good shot at the five, does well, he not, right down? Right, but I don't think he can do that. I think he's going to have to play the five up there where the nine's at. Mm. Unless it's... I don't think it goes up there, but... He making reverse his cue ball. He not the way the six is. Ball. The six is... Yeah, he's killing it. That was a nice Oof, shot. That boy. was a dangerous shot. That Oof. I don't think he had a choice. I don't think the five went in another pocket. Is that right? Unless he wanted to bump the five. Well, he's got it lined up now. Oh, yeah, he likes this. Yeah. And then the six right back up with either in the side or back up where the nine ball is. Seven and eight. And the six. Will he put it in the side pocket? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I believe he will. Just pull the cue ball over across the top of the eight. Maybe even under the eight if he can draw it. Now he's going all the way up and back. Mm -hmm. That's the way to do it. And the seven down here in the corner, and then uh, the eight and the nine. See where the cue ball's at right now? That's where he'd love to have it on the next shot. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Well, maybe Reyes would let him skip the seven and put the eight in there now, Nick. You guys are a friendly bunch in this uh, world of the pro billiard play. We're not, not quite that friendly. I see. No. I see. Oh, usually all the friendship ends with a leg. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good luck. Good luck to you. Yeah. I got your good luck right here, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Eight ball. And the nine. Nice shot. Up in the corner. Looking to take a 4-3 lead in games. Game wins the round. There's no fear of Reyes. <laughs> the Kim Davenport. This is rock number Kim eight. Kim Davenport open. Mm -hmm. That's right. Boy, nothing tonight. <clears throat> Five ball just... Isn't that amazing how much no, different made, that break's no, working he, tonight? He didn't make one either. Six, eight, no, he didn't. He came up empty. Now the one ball is... <laughs> Set up and Reyes will probably run the table now. Okay, if he can miss this six, if he can come to here and back out for the two, then he'll be all right. It, well, he hit that the was six. the problem. See, he's dead. He couldn't get away from the six, and now he snuckered behind the three. Dead in the water. Now you know why the two guys with me, Buddy Hall and Nick Varner, are such great pool players and experts. I would never have thought the six ball was a factor in that. Now it's got him. He made the two ball, or he made the one ball, and he's got himself trapped. Well, not really trapped. He can hit the ball, but he can't make it, can he? No, he can't hit it unless he hits a rail first. Yeah. And then, of course, you don't know whether unless he can... Unless he curve it. He's going to go over to that rail and come back and try to knock it up the table and end up behind this 3-7, or now he come all the way across and may snooker him with the 5. I tell you. Or 4. What a great shot. What a great shot. That was a great shot. Mm. Yeah, that was a nice defensive kick there. But I think uh, Kim may have a shot at cutting the two in. He did it. If he gets it. Oh, he overhit it. He may be all right, though. He's all right. Yes. Came away pretty good. Where can he put, can he put the three down here in the corner? All right. He play it down in the corner and just play the cue ball out in the middle of the table, I believe. Mm -hmm. Uh, he may have too stiff, stiff an angle for that. If, if so, he may end up playing the four in the side. It just depends on the angle that he has off the three. Yep, he's elevating. 
What about the nine ball? Could he make the nine ball? No. no. Huh? Combination? No, he wouldn't. You don't even think of things like that, huh? Okay, he's going to have to try to come out like this. I see. I would think. That'd be a shot trying to play the four in the upper corner. <laughs> Boy, a lot of cue action on that, wasn't there? Yeah. Huh? Yes, it was. <laughs> and hopes and prayers and what have you going along with it. See, I don't know if the five even goes by the nine, but he's got an angle where he can just come below the five now. He can play the five up in the same pocket he shoots the four in. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't play for the combination. That's the last thing in the world I would do. <laughs> I don't like shooting combinations. But well, now he's going to, he will try the combination now. Trust me on this. Because he five. can't get the five ball past it, can he? You're a combination man, He Tom. cannot get the five ball past that thing, Nick Warner, and you know it. He's going to try that nine. And I tell you, I, I'd have to try it if I were he. Well, he's got a lot of confidence in combinations. He beat Johnny Archer with a combination last week. I just think... Look at that. Look at that. wins the rap. This is rock number nine. He's just going over there to see if one might fall from that side. You mean to tell me there's a little superstition and what have you in, in games like well, this? Well, sometimes, huh? sometimes the balls will break from one side better than they will the other. He's not hitting that cue ball. Scratched. Scratched. That cue well, ball's going way up in the air. Ball in hand anywhere on the table. After it hits a one, it's mm -hmm. jumping. Mm -hmm. Well, where is he hitting it to get that effect off it, Nick? Is he hitting it too low that it pops it up or what? Too high, I think. Too high, yeah. and it causes it to... When it hits the, the rack, it just pops in the air, is that what we're saying? Yeah, and I honestly think he's hitting them too hard. Trying to do too much with them. Yeah, you know, that adrenaline may be too strong. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, Reyes now, given an opportunity to get back into it, he trails five games to three in the race to 11. I just think Reyes is so good that you give him a chance to even take that cue in his hand, get up off that chair, you're courting danger. Uh, he, he is that good a player. He, you gotta, you, you've got to keep him away from the table. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I think in watching him play over the weeks and on the tour this year, we've seen him probably, I don't know, maybe I've seen him make five bad mistakes in all of the matches. and. So far, he's been able to overcome almost all of them. Magnificent position player, and he does wonderful things with the cue ball. He's got this all set, the five in the corner, six, seven, eight, right in the middle of the table. Well, I know his sponsor's got to be pretty happy this year, AMF Poyat and uh, Jose Poyat in uh, the Philippines, and I'm sure they're wired to this match tonight, mm -hmm. and uh, I'd uh, like to say on behalf of the Pro Billiards Tour, he's been a real strong sponsor and supporter of the Pro Billiards Tour. I'd like to say hello and uh, wish him a, uh, all the best, huh? All the best. And I understand they're working right now on uh, Don Mackey, the commissioner, is working on uh, negotiations to take the Pro Billiards Tour to the Philippines next year in 96. Oh, I would think that would be... Everett wins the rap. Well this is rap number 10. The cue ball here, trying to find out how to jar him loose. Ooh, what do you mean? One, yeah, he made the one ball, too. And he's got good position on the two. See, he let up on it a little bit and hit a little off to the left-hand side of the one. He I think has you're a right here. This is the three ball right here. He has to figure out a way to get all the way down table. And he didn't do it. No, I think he came up short. He did not do it. And in fact, he has snookered himself. He's going to have to go off a rail. To look at him. He's really upset with that shot. Well, I think he should have played it two rails. He should have played, played the ball two rails around. I know something from the look on his face. I think he thinks you're right. And that he wishes he could have done it again. He's, the only way he can hit this thing, Nick, is come off the rail, isn't it? Yeah, he's yeah. got to kick it off this rail to the left and, and uh, try to make contact with the threes. 
Nice. Mm. I even left Kim a shot here. Yes, he has. And uh, the four ball is up at that end, am I correct? Is that yes. it up there? Yep. And then he's got to get back for the five. If he gets that three and then gets the four, comes back for the five and the six, why, he's in pretty good shape to run this rank. Can Kim draw over and catch that right rail and stay down for the four, or does he have to run into the four here? No, he can draw all the way over to the side rail and back out. I believe he can play the three in here, draw his cue ball to the side rail and back out. Worst comes to worst, he can just draw his ball over here. That He has to hit the ball too soft to do that. I believe he'll go ahead and hit it. I believe he'll draw it one rail out. Very deliberate in this Same shot. like he's trying to make up his mind. Yeah. Yeah, I think, Nick, you've hit it right on the head. He's a little indecisive. I wonder if he selected the right play. Yep, he played it soft. Yeah. Got away a beautiful oh, shot. That's a tough shot there. Yep. He made a great shot. Great position on the four ball. He must have had to cut it too much to draw it over there. Well, how's he going to get down now for the five? Is that kind of routine, or is it not that easy? Right, it's not an easy shot at all. He's He's got a situation here that's, that's pretty much a problem. He's going to have to go down and play the combination on the... He's either going to have to drop all the way below the five or play the combination on the nine in the corner, in the side pocket. Well, now you're talking my kind of pool, boys. We're back to that combination on the nine ball. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, Kim, make this baby, and then we'll get to work on that combination. I like playing the two rails all the way to the end rail and playing the five up in the other corner. See how you are? I thought you were the adventuresome type, buddy. Oh, oh he missed that. Oh, maybe you can get a break. Catch he was trying to play position for the same pocket, wasn't he, buddy? Yeah. Yes, he was. So, the five ball is really a, a problem here. You know what I like here, buddy? Rail I like playing. No, I like just playing the four, bouncing off and banking that ball and leaving the cue ball behind the eight and nine and banking that next shot. He played rail first. He's oh, gonna he? make it, gonna make it, gonna make it. Oh. And he snookered himself behind the nine. You know, he almost pulled off an unbelievable shot, didn't he? Well, he left the four in. He was playing rail first and playing oh. the four down the corner. It, it oh, banked I see. this rail you and banked. He got away with something. Right. And but what see, did he watch get the away way with? the ball goes. Yeah. Five four. Davenport leads. This is Reyes now. He's playing the nine probably. No, he's ducking. Oh 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 oh. He's lucky. You oh <laughs> boy. <laughs> he got lucky there. Mm. He got lucky there. When you get down to where there's four balls on the table and the cue ball, and you can't afford to make a mistake here. Yeah, so right. what's what's uh, Kim going to do? He, the only way he can hit that five is come off a rail and hit it, and then what does he do? Well, he may be able to hit the edge of it. Well, you think he can? Yeah, if he can hit the edge of it, it's not gonna, he's just going to bring the cue ball back over to this well, side of the table. Well, if he can hit the edge, he can make it, can't he? No. No. All right. Is he going to go between the six and the nine? Right. Right, I think that's what he's going to try to do. Bank it one reel right up by the diamond there. Yeah, he's playing safe here. No, he didn't. He did something different. Well, he laid it right in there between the six and the eight. Can Ephraim make this rail first, or does he have to go to the right rail? Uh, I believe he might can play it rail first. Can't reach it though, can he? To put that little curve on it he needs, maybe. <laughs> well, he can shoot. We'll see if he shoots this one opposite-handed, buddy. <laughs> no, he's not going to shoot that one opposite-handed. Yes, he is going to shoot. Yes, that one. <laughs> you ready for that? He's going to climb right up on that table. Oh, ball in hand. Wow. Yeah. Uh, that's ball in hand, and this rack is going Davenport to go to Davenport. Ball in hand. You know what he done there, Nicky? He took the value of the shot over the disability of having to shoot it left-handed. The shot just had some, so much more value playing it that way yeah. that he just decided to go ahead and shoot it left-handed. Now, is this a big, as big a lock as I think it is? Will, will Davenport just run these four on him now? He should, yeah. yeah. He should just run right out. I don't Boy. know what he's doing here. He's drawing back. Mm -hmm. Wow. I tell you what, uh, he got a little bit of trouble with that draw shot. Well, I would have played it over in the opposite corner anyway. You know, all he's got to do is just stop his ball for the seven. I mean, he's not thinking there. Well, can't he make that six and still stop the ball right there for the well, seven? Well, yeah, but now he's got to work. He may have to go three rails for the seven. 
You gotta make the six first, which apparently is not that big a chore. All right. And yeah, he's going three rails. He's hit it. Great. Come on, little speed. more. Needs that right that's it right there. Yeah. That's a pretty shot, too. Mm -hmm. Perfect angle. Now the nine ball. So Reyes. Um, Kim wins the round. This is rock number 11. Change in venue and a little better action. He broke the uh, rack magnificently in his victory over Steve Miserak. He gets one ball in the corner and oh, Ooh, he almost oh, scored with disaster there. Mm. And he is snuckered, but uh, yeah, I believe he's okay here. Yeah. He, he's got a couple of options here. Would he have to cut the one ball back in the corner up on top? Right. Didn't he? Yeah. Right. You either draw it or you follow it down behind two reels behind the seven. He's going to go two reels down behind the seven. Beautiful. Beautiful. Really dangerous. He pulls off shots that he makes them look just ordinary. He's really in a predicament here. He's got to watch this point. This is the ball that he has to play position on right here. He really got his work cut out for him. Oh, man, he hit it great. Didn't he? Oh, what a nice mm -hmm. touch. Now he's already got the three ball set and he's checking the rest of the table to find out where he's going next. Three and the four aren't a problem, are they? No, but the four to the five could be. Yes, he's a long way away, but what does he do now with it? Put the four in the corner up there and then bring it all the way down to the five, huh? He either brings it on past the seven or above the seven. I don't know which he's going to do. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. Where will he get position for the six? Where is he going to... Right there, you can get it by the nine, huh? Yep, same puck. No problem? No problem. You just pull it back a little bit and shoot and stop, shoot and stop. Yeah. <laughs> Makes easy work of it, doesn't he? He's gonna tie this match up at six games apiece. Efren Reyes. And now the nine ball across the table in the corner. And just that quickly, he has erased a 6-4 deficit. This is rock number 13. Success there. Nothing. And he came up empty this time, and I believe he's going to leave a shot. Davenport with a shot. Let's have a shot. I don't, I don't know if the two will pass, will pass by the four. If it won't, then he'll have to go all the way down the table and play the two on the side. Scott Smith, the referee, hey, here's the one offering ball the bridge. In right here. This is the two ball. If it'll pass here, then he'll probably play the cue ball in this line. But if that's not a possibility, then he'll play it straight back down table to this area to play the two in the side. For me, you got to have a real touch right here to get that one. Very deliberate with this. Nicely Plan done. Inside. Beautifully done. Brings it back down to the position for the two. Put that in the side pocket now, Willie. Yep. Looks like it. Or is he banking it? I think he might be banking it. Boy, he didn't <laughs> bank it. He drilled it. <laughs> Nick, he drilled it. That's what that you puppy. call a slam dunk. Or... Boy, isn't it? I mean, if that uh, if the pocket hadn't been there to turn the whole side of that table out with that. I tell you, these guys could wait in alligators. <laughs> They've got lots, lots of courage. They can play. They don't mind hitting the ball hard if you if that's what it takes. What's he gonna do about position on the four? Well, 
He's just going to come on the right side of the five off that end rail with a little bit of right English on the cue ball. He hit him mm -hmm. inside. He'll come back down four, and then he's got to go back up for the five. The six is up at that end as well. And I don't see any problems. Uh, all he's got to do is stay in line. Yeah, he'll just come down table and play the four ball in the same pocket he just played the three ball in. Table. Must have been worried about hitting a seven or something. What does he do for the six then? Just force it. Force it over. Very nice. Beautiful. Looks like he has a big chance to run this rack and take a seven six lead. Boy, this title match is every bit as advertised. He's sawing back and forth. Neither man is able to get more than a two game advantage over the other. But neither man can afford the luxury of making a mistake. When they do, they end up paying for it. Right. $15,000 goes to the winner. $7,500 to second place. So you got room? Oh, yeah. He just put one reel out, playing oh, both yeah, in the same 20. pocket. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> But he's getting all worked up over here, Nick. <laughs> We're heading Game the wins the rack. This is rough number 14. Things. There you go. Nine ball. Nine ball. Nine ball. Made it. Made it. Look at the smile, huh? Yeah, he liked that one. Boy, what's to hate when that nine ball goes <laughs> silent? Boy, watch this again. And what a great shot we had of that rack. And watch it now from afar. And look at that nine ball just headed toward that lower right-hand corner. And hey, it made it again. Even wins the, the rack. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to defend his pro tour title. <laughs> I think he might have a farm or two he could this sell him anyway. Number 15. <laughs> Name the tournament <laughs> after him. Huh? Hang his picture up over at Dad's pool hall. Boy, Nick's got all kinds of things going now. He's thinking about it. Here's, <laughs> here's Davenport again <laughs> trying to make that nine ball again. Yeah, let's we'll see what happens. It's got a better. chance, got oh. a chance. Yeah, wait. Oh, he got a shot. Yep. And look where he's got that one ball. He's got a shot. Oh, boy. I predict your shot before this game's over. Okay, he has the wood ball right here. What are you talking about? He's Can playing position a, uh -huh. yeah. on the three yeah. right here. Yeah. I believe he'll play the cue ball one rail and back out here. The final shot. Going to be the 6-9? It's going to be the six nine combination. <laughs> Buddy Hall's got me all set. We can get down to the six nine boys. Just give it to me and stand back. I'll show you how to make that puppy. I know one thing. What we call Tom if he played this game, his nickname would be Combination Tom. <laughs> That's, That's right. That's his nickname anyway. Whether he's going to play it or not. <laughs> That's what we're talking about. That six nine, but we got to make the three before we can get around to me shooting that six nine. Well, I tell you this. If Davenport doesn't do it, you give it to Reyes and he'll do it. Uh, I think Kim's going to do it. He played for the angle. Yeah. Four ball. Played for the angle. You just go one rail up and down, boys. <laughs> you just play it one rail, I believe. You think you'll play it one rail? Nick, or you think you'll draw it? Yeah, he's kind of on the borderline. He's going a little bit toward the seven. He may have to draw out of there, I think. You did no, see No, he's going forward. He's going forward, like you said, buddy. You did see him go over there and eyeball no, that six nine, though, didn't you? He's drawn mm -hmm. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I believe he's drawn it. No, he did change his mind. Right there. Right there. <laughs> there you are. I mean, are we lined up just a slight angle here? Not, seriously, how tough is that combination? 
Yeah, well, it's not very I tough. I like him shooting this one. Yeah. You do, huh? Yeah, he's... Do you like him making it? Yes. Yeah. I think that's a Kelly lock right there. Hello. Oh, oh he hit the outside. Lord. I think he hit that a little too hard. I would have oh, never hit that ball that hard. Why would he... You're right. I think he shot... Why did he shoot that hard? Oh, I don't know. I can't believe he... Played, I, I don't believe either. he hit the outside of the nine. I Boy, that nine ball looked like it was done. Look at his, how his, his he cut the down. six too much. How yeah. can he hit the outside of that ball? You don't shoot that shot hard. And he's over there talking to himself. He'd break a cue if he... Oh, boy. Boy, what a big game that was mm. for him. Mm. Well, that could have gone up 10-6. Yes, it could. Know. That could come back to Oh, yeah, there. Reyes will put that seven away in the eight. Yeah, it'll it'll be a, I tell you what, he's going to have to oh, shoot oh, oh, this opposite-handed oh, oh, and spin oh, oh. it in. We're going to see a left-handed spin shot here. Well, I, I can't you. believe Kim shot that shot like that. What's he going to do with this? He's going to spin it in left-handed, I think. You mean he's going to bring it back down the other end? Or mm -hmm. put it in that corner? We killed it sure. opposite-handed. Oh. What kind of stroke was that, buddy? That was a pretty powerful stroke. Wow. It was free. <laughs> yeah, that was a powerful stroke. And now the nine ball, and Kim Davenport looks over and says, how could I have left that for him? How could I have given this? Have a the a big opportunity. Kim has got away. As it is, he still leads, but it's 8-7 now, and it could have been 9-6 in the race to 11. What a... Reyes with the break. Games are tied at eight all. This is from number 17. He made one. Yep. Hit the point. He got a shot. Yep. So Reyes. He has a problem here. I don't know if, if the one ball will pass here, then he may be able to play the cue ball down this side. This is the two ball right here. If he doesn't have either one of those options, he'll probably play the cue ball to right here. He'll probably play safe if he doesn't have that option. All right, what he did have. Yeah. He just underhit it. Too soft. He didn't give himself any kind of a shot at that two ball. He's going to have to come off the rail, I think, to hit it. Deadlocked at eight games apiece now big moment in this uh, match for the title was when Davenport had a 6-9 combination and cut the 6 too much. He was leading 8 games to 6, could have been 9-6, instead it went to 8-7, and then Reyes came on to win and make it 8-8. And so, it is deadlocked and pressure-packed now in the race to 11 as Reyes walks around the table eyeballing that 2-ball. Going to have to come off the rail to hit it, does he? Right, he, he may have a shot, actually have a shot at the two ball here. If he can get underneath it just a little bit, he may be able to kiss the two off of the four into the corner pocket. Well, He'll kick two real solid into the two. He was looking into the crowd as if to seek help from Rolando or some of the members of the Filipino national team or his fellow countrymen. But we'll see how he does, buddy. Mm. He tried that. Yeah, oh, he got lucky. Look at that. Look at that. Look what I found. Look what I found. I've played golf with guys who do that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not trying to say they maybe chip one in once in a while. Oh, yes. I mean, from behind a tree. It's a rock. It's a tree. <laughs> Falls into the guy says, boy, I couldn't have played it any better. By that time, <laughs> you want to take his wedge and just bury it <laughs> inside his shirt. You play the three and play the cue ball to this area right in here, and then play the billiard on the eight for this corner pocket. What about the combination, buddy? I don't think so. The combination is not that good. He'll play the billiard. I think the billiard instead of the combination. He wants to try to lag the four right to the rail. That is, that is beautifully done. I mean, the man can play this game without any effort. He makes that eight ball and just rolls, huh? I believe that combination is going to come back to haunt Kim. Boy, isn't that a shame? 
Here's Reyes now looking to take a lead for one of the, the few moments in this match. And now he comes down for the nine ball to take a lead of 9-8. He was down 8-6. Might have been down 9-6. And he's fought his way back now to take a lead of 9-8. Everett wins the round. This is rock number 18. What an important rack this is. What an important break. Yeah. And he's going to have a shot at the one ball. After all that, huh? That's a shot at the three. He's got a shot at going, getting to the hill first. Well, that's right. I'm looking at the five, thinking five is the, the one. Gets to the five, he's liable to play a combination like the nine. That's a real good chance of that. <laughs> you like that? You know where you pick those combinations up pretty quick here. <laughs> he pick them out, he starts looking for them as soon as the rack's broke. Yeah. <laughs> I said, didn't come in to get a haircut. Let's gamble now. Let's get out of <laughs> Boy, you know, I hate to harp on it, but you're right. That combination 6-9, the Davenport, boy, that may just be. Hey, man, we have seen. Here. I'm sorry. I'll go ahead, buddy. Just trying to come across. Here it comes. Here it comes. You're looking at it now. 5-9 to go up 10-8. This is rock number 19. Referee racks him up. Reyes eyeballs the the rack. Dev. Davenport just looking on. Tell you something, that cue ball just did a dance in there. It looked as though I wouldn't have been surprised he'd pop out. Well, all right. Kim, you've got a big time chance right here. Let's see if you can do it now. You're down 10 8. Reyes has run off three straight games on you. He's got a shot here, I believe. He's going to play the one right here. Stop his cue ball right there where this ball's at so he can play this ball in and come to this area for position on the three. No, he played it down below. Mm. Okay. That's perfect. That's Yeah, that's perfect angle. Nick says he likes it. Now Buddy yeah, says like he lower. likes it. Put it up in the corner. Looks like he's got to be a little careful on that. What he is, though, gentlemen, is in a position where he cannot make a mistake. <coughs> We've seen him in that one yes. before. Yes, yes, and he has been equal to the task. Now, he's got that three-ball position nicely, and the five, six, seven. He has every availability to run this table here and get right back into this. But he can't make a mistake. He has to play solid pool from here on out. <laughs> right there. Five, take it up for the six and the seven. He's trailing ten, eight. Something to bridge up. It's not terrible. Mm. Mm -hmm. Boy, it got quiet in here all of a sudden, didn't it? Huh? <laughs> well, we're 
getting down to the... That's right. To the wow. short strokes. The best match. Oh, what a beautifully played position on that. If he makes the nine, the plot thickens. Game wins the rack. This is rock number two. Davenport not a break. Needs to make a ball here. Needs to run this rack to bring it to ten even. Boy, you hit some hard. Came up empty. Came up empty. Came up dry. Drive. I don't think he has a shot though. What about cutting that one in this upper corner, but then swing around two rails for the two? Wait. Then it's over. He may not have to do that. He may be able to play the one all the way down and just bump this rail and come back out. This is the two right here. Oh, okay. That's what he's doing. No, no he's playing safe. He's ducking. Oh, he ducks. Boy, he's ducking. Wow. Protecting that one game, isn't he? Well, he does have that one game advantage. He can afford to have this game go away, and he still would be no worse than dead even, even though uh, Kim would have the break. But he does have that advantage. I believe I'd have had to shoot if I had a shot. To oh, I think take so, it off. too. As good as he can play, I think I don't think that was a tough shot, that one ball in the corner. No, he's very capable of making that shot. Yeah. Plus, he'd have had that cue ball back up where the two is. And... Tough shot for Davenport. Missed it. Well, maybe the strategy is going to be 100% now for Rams. He has a ball in hand. He may play the nine ball here, huh? No. Now you're getting to talk like that announcer Kelly and combinations and all that. <laughs> You got me tricked up. Or I, I, I did that trick you right into that. <laughs> yeah, you're talking like Combination Kelly. That's right. <laughs> Reyes is looking that over. I don't know. <laughs> Let's not throw that thought away too soon. <laughs> Do you see any problem there, buddy? I, I don't, don't see. I don't. I think it's a lock now. I think all he's got to do is make sure he gets on the three. And just Katie bar the door. Mm -hmm. well, you don't want to get behind the four. Oh, golly. <laughs> you know, before he shot that, I was thinking I might hit that with just a hair or a reverse and stay on that side. He could have followed it. He That's what I meant. Yeah. And Reyes had the look on his face of, I can't believe I did that. And he looked into the crowd as if to say, that wasn't me. What happened here? They're from smiling on the outside and crying mm -hmm. on the inside. That's right. That's right. Boy, I guess there are no locks. Huh? There are no certainties. He has made some marvelous shots, though. He's done some tremendous. Are you kidding me? You know, he almost made that in the side. Uh, well, Kim's got a shot. That's a whole lot more than he had. That's right, sitting down over there. That's right. <laughs> I think that's important in this situation. You've got to take the attitude that it's, uh, you're just fortunate to be at the table yeah. one more time, even though he's in a tough position. That's right. Yeah. Count your blessings and make the most of it. Now, yeah. see, reach back for a little magic. This kid has been tough. Inside, he's been very tough. Defending champion. This is a hard shot. Yeah, especially elevating up like that. Look out. Look out. Look out. Nine ball. Nine ball. Nine ball. Nine ball. Oh. He almost locked the nine in. Oh. I thought it was going for a second. I do. So did the crowd. Kim looked at it as if to say, how about that? What happened? 
Well, what about Reyes now, gentlemen? He's got a uh, shot at the three, isn't he? He's got to make sure he gets a shot at the four. You know, I'm trying to hit the four square from behind. Or maybe he's going to just spin it out there. He wouldn't try to make that nine ball with some kind of a... Oh, all right. Is he going to slice this one in the corner, buddy? Well, he shot one down in the corner here here a while back. Didn't he? That was a lot tougher than this one. He's magnificent at these thin little cut shots. The second thought on that, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. I prefer, actually, this shot here, the way it's laying to bank it. Well, let me tell you. You know, you can't, I don't care how good he is. He can't make a mistake. That nine ball's just hanging there. That's a Kelly nine ball right there. Mm -hmm. Just hanging, waiting. Can't make a mistake. I think he's looking at your shot on the bank, huh? I thought he should shoot at the bank. Davenport is hoping he makes a mistake so that he can get back up there. It's 10-9 in favor of Reyes. That's the shot I like right there. Can he make the five in that corner? Well, it has a pocket, but I would have played position. I wouldn't have played the safety. He built the safety into it with a six. I would have went ahead and played position. I wouldn't have ducked. I would have been shooting. Mm -hmm. Hit that ball good. Yeah. Yep. That's a great shot there. I think it's over, gentlemen. We thought that earlier, didn't we? Yes, but I really do think this is over, unless he does something really uncharacteristic and buries the cue ball behind the eight or something, I don't think. Yeah. Look at him. <laughs> Kim just sits there and thinks. He's going to come across on the short side, isn't he? Yeah, I think so. So it's come down to this. The eight ball and the nine ball just hanging there. Now the nine ball. Reyes makes that. He's the Pro Tour champion. wins the match. Congratulations. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in every video. Peace out.